Hi, I'm Caitlin. Hi, I'm Zach. We're siblings who vlog Disney cruises and adventures. Today we're back at Steakhouse 71 to try it for lunch. We just did a video on it for breakfast and now we're going to attempt the lunch and see how we like it. So let's go. So here's the menu for lunch. You can pause the video and take a look if you want. I think we're going to skip the appetizers today, right? We don't want to do an appetizer. I might do a dessert. No, I don't now. want any. For starters, I'm going to go with the prime rib sandwich. Shaved prime rib, caramelized onions, herb aioli, provolone, arugula, and horseradish cream. Horseradish cream, which is the only thing that I'm a little nervous about. I've never had that, so we'll see. A list of the specialty cocktails that they have available for lunch and dinner as well as non-alcoholic beverages. Oh look, they have a Minute Maid Zero Sugar Lemonade with, uh, with a souvenir cup. That's pretty cool for $6. This is my favorite restaurant at Disney that we've ate at so far. It's a 10 out of 10 for breakfast at least. So we'll see how lunch is. I do take pass holder discount. I'm surprised you're not getting the stack burger. I don't want a burger. Zachary's so getting the turkey club, which is oven roasted turkey, applewood smoked bacon, lemon aioli, lettuce, tomato, served on brioche bread. I taste like root beer. I don't know. Sweet. You taste like root beer? A little bit. Not you got a way. Diet Coke? Yeah, it kind of tastes like a root beer. All right, well, let me try mine. I have a Diet Coke as well. I think it's the ice. So here is my prime rib sandwich. It looks delicious. And then it came with a side of fries with some condiments on the side. It's mayonnaise. Well. Yeah, I think it's. I guess it's mayonnaise. What else? It has to be. Yeah, I this guess is, it's mayonnaise, and then yours is the turkey sub, right? Turkey club, the fries, and the french fries. Fries are crunchy. They have seasoning on them. It kind of tastes like Arby's uh, curly fries. Mmm, I like, like yeah, that. Yeah, I would like that. That sounds good to me. This good. It tastes like a regular club sandwich. It's so not anything fancy. Uh, it's okay. Breakfast, I think, was better, but it's still good. The bacon's crispy. It tastes like a regular turkey club sandwich. The bacon's crispy and stuff. So, like bacon, lettuce, turkey, mayonnaise. If you don't like mayonnaise, I think it's actually aioli. Not oh, aioli. Well, okay. As I showed you, the french fries are waffle style. Dip it into ketchup. She also brought additional ketchup for us, which was nice. They do taste like Arby's french fries. At first they don't, they're like dry, but... Yeah, the seasoning on it tastes like Arby's seasoning. Which isn't bad. Look at this horseradish cream. What? Yeah, it's horseradish cream. Ice cream. Horseradish no. cream, I think. I don't know, you try it. You can dip it if you want. It's actually not that bad. This is messy, so come prepared for that. Oh my god, I smell the caramelized onion. This is very greasy, but it's really good. It is very messy. Uh, it's good though. <clears throat> the style of sandwich reminds me of a Philly cheesesteak. Like, that's what it reminds me of. Obviously, it's not. But that's what the style reminds me of. Ooh, this is just really messy. The fries, I think, are very crispy. And if you like that, that's good. The sandwich is a little messy. But it tastes really, really good. I honestly, they have like to-go boxes, which I will see. I probably will need, but yeah, if they do, I will take it with me to go. Um, I think overall, do I think it's worth the price? Personally, I think I'd rather come breakfast. for for breakfast. Yeah, like Zachary said, 
Your breakfast, I think, is better. Breakfast is better, but it's still it's, it's still, still good. good. If you want a nice dining experience, sit down. It's good. I prefer breakfast as well. I mean, the lunch is still good, but breakfast is way better. So. The breakfast food just tastes better. Portion size is worth the price, in my opinion. Here's a look at the dessert menu, as well as specialty cocktails and hot beverages. Feel free to pause the menu if you want to take a better look. I think we're going to get the espresso martini creme brulee. Espresso martini creme brulee is espresso creme brulee with marcona almond chocolate crunch and cocoa whipped cream. This will be the true test if it cracks. Did not. A crack right there. Didn't crack right there though. Should try it's definitely burnt. You know, like when it's burnt, so you should try with this stuff. Right That's what I'm gonna do. What, well, you don't take yours yet. I want to get your reaction. It tastes like an almond crunch bar, or not an almond, a crunch bar. Yeah, like the chocolate candy bars that you get. That's what it tastes like. It's not almond crunch. It's a Hershey, huh? isn't it? Mm hmm Or Nestle. Well, that's it tastes like coffee for sure and tastes like a, a crunch oh. bar. It's supposed to be espresso martini. I don't taste that. I just taste regular taste coffee. Like... I taste coffee. I taste coffee and then like a crunch Maybe bar. Maybe I need to get it in a different spot. I taste coffee. You don't taste coffee. Mm -hmm. I do. Oh, now I taste the coffee. Now I taste the coffee. Mmm. Do I think that tasted like an espresso martini? No. Would I get that again? Absolutely. The total was $55.19. That includes a creme brulee, as well as our drinks and our food. <coughs> and it took 10% off with our annual pass holder discount. And of course, it has the tip uh, suggest amount suggested below. Okay, so that was our experience at Steakhouse 71 for lunch. How did you like it? It was okay. I rated about a 7 out of 10. The creme brulee was 10 out of 10, but the actual food is 7 out of 10. That's what I was going to say. The creme brulee saved it. The, if my recommendation would either be coming... We haven't gone for dinner, but my recommendation, just based on the breakfast and lunch that we've had, I would either come for breakfast or come for dinner. Yeah. So my rating would probably be a 7 out of 10. So, what is that? That's a seed, right? Oh, all right. So, yeah, that's what I feel like the mini was. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. And we'll see you in your next video. Bye.